my ghosts on this episode we talk about going to a one percent of party popping up at that clubhouse any event that they're throwing the proper protocol and we get into it on this episode of demons road tv and oh yeah we ghosting baby Welcome to Demons Row TV, the holy grail of MC culture, where we cover everything motorcycle club involved. I'm Sos the Ghost, I'm your host for the evening, and today we're going to talk about it. Going to a 1% of clubhouse, going to a 1% of event, what is the proper protocol? Can you go over there and have a good time, or is it very strict? We're going to get into it, but the first thing I want you to do, like we always do on this channel, is to hit me with that pound ghosting and that lets me know you're alive and well sitting on twos doing what you do or just part of the demons row community one of my ghosts shout to all my new subscribers welcome to the row follow the Sos the ghost page a lot of content coming out on that one and also shout to everybody that's been supporting the demons row clothing but let's start this one off with something new it's a new tradition i'm starting and what it is i'm gonna call it the certified ghost step every week i'm gonna feature a new woman on this channel on this segment it will be the queens of this road the queens of motorcycle culture i want to have women that are not just a pretty face with some small shorts on standing in front of motorcycle these women will own their motorcycle and they are queens of the road so we're gonna set it off like this the first ever certified ghost stat big shout to vil shiny from california on instagram is just underscore the underscore letter underscore v big shout to v i was very impressed with her profile she's indian and italian she lives in California, but spent her teen years and half her 20s in France and Switzerland. Very exotic. She has an Indian Scout and a Harley. So she's doing it big. 100 pounds soaking wet, and she's cruising through these streets as you can see on the footage. So big shout to V, much love. You are my first certified ghost that. If you know anybody that's certified ghost that material, hit us on at Demons Row on Instagram. We will check everybody out. I wanted to show love to everybody in this culture, so we're gonna keep that going and we're gonna come with the certified ghost too. So y'all hit me with that. But let's get into it. Going to a one percent of party or an event. It could be at their clubhouse, it could be at a spot they rented. The first step we're gonna take, if you're pulling up, come with respect no revving the bikes up going all crazy making noise in that town you don't know what they got going on you don't know what type of pressure when you're in a one percent club that they have from police in the neighborhood if they want to use that as an excuse so you don't want to start off on the wrong foot making mad noise it's like you going to somebody's house or something show respect when you walk through that door when you get to the door just remember there's always cameras in 1% clubhouses. So they're gonna be looking out and they could see you. So whatever you doing, don't do no nut shit that's gonna get you caught up. And I'm not saying 1%ers is, is over here to disrespect people. I'm just saying, you mess with anyone's house, they're gonna protect their house. So when you pull up, knock on that door, wait for them to come. Don't be banging on the door. Don't do no crazy shit. Now I know a lot of 99s have these rules where you bypass people and you go straight to the president and salute them i've heard this a lot in 99 clubs i would not advise you to do that in a one percent clubhouse you say what's up to everybody you walk by you don't walk by a member 
and assume that you have to go say what's up to the president and walk into that house and disrespect them and not say nothing to them like i don't even know like how that rule got put out but it's a rule that can get people into trouble and another rule i'm gonna tell you i don't care what club you're fully passed of or whatever do not disrespect a prospect people think that because you're in a certain club and you're fully patched that you could disrespect another club's prospect let me tell you something i've seen a lot of people get washed up for thinking that a prospect oh he's not a member let me talk to him greasy they don't care about you that's their their brother in the making so you could get yourself really caught up over crossing the wrong prospect do not talk down on prospects in a one percent club especially if you're in a 99 if you're in another one percent club you already know if you go to a spot there's certain protocols but never talk down a prospect i don't care who you think you are i don't care if you're a president vp sergeant arms i don't care who you are don't down talk a prospect in a one percent club in their house it's not gonna end well because i know if somebody comes to the house and they disrespect them, one of my little homies is gonna be a problem you know what i'm saying so i'm just telling you for real that's one thing that'll save you from problems i know a lot of people have told me that they were told by presidents by people in control that you don't go up to a one percenter until he comes up to you but i'm telling you if you go to a clubhouse you say what's up to everybody and show them that respect and trust me they'll be happy you there and they'll be happy that you're showing love and supporting the bar and that's a very important thing to do if you want to get in good with a club support the bar if you spend money at that bar, you're helping that club out with whatever bills they got, whatever's going on, you're helping them out with that. So if you want to get in good with a 1% club, that's an easy way right there. Cop some motherfucking whatever you like to drink and you will make them happy. They will rock with you. Now, if you see girls there, I would be very leery to talk to women in a 1% clubhouse or in a 1% event. You don't know who's with who. Now, if they're old lady and they have on their cut that they're an old lady property of, listen, I've seen it before. Do not think that you're cool. Maybe she's looking at you or being friendly or whatever. Do not make the mistake of thinking that maybe she's single and you can go talk to her for people that are new because a lot of people that watch this channel are new to clubs. They might have just, this might be their first time stepping into a 1% clubhouse. If you've been in one before, you already know, please do not act like everything just goes without saying, because it doesn't. Because if you've never been in a club before, if a girl, if a pretty woman looks at you and she's smiling and being nice to you, you probably are gonna nine times out of 10 think she likes you. So don't act like, you know, it's out of this world for somebody to kick it to an old lady. It happens. So any women in a one percent clubhouse i mean just in the mc world in general i think that you should stay away from the women it's not really the place it's not the scene to meet women because you don't know who's who it could be not an old lady but it's somebody's little sister or something like that you got to be very leery of the women that you deal with women can get you jammed up another thing you're going to want to do with the pictures i know this is a social media era everybody likes to take pictures dope cameras you know what i mean you got your your old lady with you or your girlfriend and you want to take a picture in the clubhouse first off you don't pull phones out and take pictures in a one percent of clubhouse you have to ask somebody because you, they might think that you police you don't know and this isn't about being tough this is about protocol this is about respecting someone's house so don't ever let someone tell you oh i'm too tough to move a certain way it's not tough to be disrespectful it's tough when you're faced with adversity and you rise from it but being a knucklehead is not being tough so it's just respect so if you in that clubhouse just ask one of the brothers is it okay if we take pictures or do you don't you don't allow pictures or whatever a lot of one percent clubhouses they're not gonna want the pictures if they allow it which some will it's fine take the pictures they might even have a film crew if it's like you know like an annual or something nine out of ten there's gonna be pictures flying everywhere the one thing i tell you be careful who is in the background of your pictures because if you're taking a picture and you got some whatever you know team a you know club a and they're they're whatever color and they have drama with team b if team b looks on instagram and they see in your pictures you got them in the background 
they can affiliate you with them and you can have problems wherever you live so you have to be very careful with pictures and once again i say this is for people that don't know because a lot of people are, are know-it-alls they were born knowing everything about mc culture but there's a lot of people that don't know this is for them and i would also say this involves everything in mc culture don't be the funny guy don't be the guy that jokes around too much now if you know people like that and you want to joke around with them that's fine you know what i mean you already have a rapport you know how they roll they ain't sweating it that's fine but if you don't know people don't get too familiar don't ask about patches don't ask about insignia don't ask when the club started how it started don't ask any inner club questions just small talk you know whatever's going on do not touch a one percenters back patch when you don't touch a one percenters cut period when you give them a pound if they try to pull you in and bring it in just bring it in without touching their back center patch do not touch that center patch i've seen stupid shit happen because of that you know what i mean some people don't care i'm not gonna lie some people don't care about stuff like that and it's not strict protocol but don't be the one to bump into the wrong club that's very strict about that and then end up in a bad situation that goes for any mc don't touch their cuts like people work hard and prospect for long periods of time to earn those cuts so don't put your hands on nobody's cuts nobody know where your hands been don't touch people's cuts don't touch people's old ladies it's just common you know respect type shit but you know everybody doesn't learn common respect from home i'm giving you the street version if you're new to this and you never been through this before how you could not get caught up going to a one percent of clubhouse also one thing i wanted to talk about that somebody asked me about is the helmets putting the helmets on the table and stuff like that when you show up to a one percent clubhouse put your helmet on your bike don't go into a one percent clubhouse with anything that could be deemed as a weapon because then they're going to make you look stupid and tell you to put it back and then you got to go back and put it back like don't do shit like that also if you have any weapons on you do not go into a one percent clubhouse with weapons because they're gonna assume that you're making a move on them you don't want those type of problems if you're just going there to have fun and overall people have asked me so can i go to a one percent clubhouse just to have a good time i say yes and i say no if i was going somewhere to have fun a one percent clubhouse is the last place i would want to go to you want to go somewhere where you're free and you can have fun and there's no rules and you know i mean there's rules everywhere but you don't want no strict rules where if you mess up it's going to end up bad for you and your team because i've seen women stomped out with a man like I've seen one percenters grab a woman's ass and then get stomped out and then they man get stomped out with them is I've seen some shit man and I'm trying to put the knowledge out there so people don't get caught up in the dumb shit and I'm not saying one percenters just target people this is stuff that's happened over the years it's not like an all the time thing because you know what MC culture they know how to respect so if you go into a one percent clubhouse to have fun it can be done depending on the club depending on your relationship with the club with people in the club you got a family member in that club then yeah you could probably have fun because you know they're gonna protect you from any you know dumb shit that may occur but you know women go there and they dance and they have fun and stuff like that you know but also me i have a certain rule if you are the one percent clubhouse i don't care if you're in a 99 one percent whatever a lot of people don't do this it's just a personal rule of mine of how i roll in the street you don't bring your old lady to a one percent of clubhouse because somebody grab a ass or some shit like that now you gotta you know it's a liability go with your homies and you hold it down you don't bring females to a one percent of house you leave the old ladies at home if you go into a one percent of clubhouse so i'm not saying let anybody disrespect you i'm just telling you how things can happen and then you from there you choose the road that you want to take but you you know what you signed up for you know what i mean you don't get caught up blindsided if you have any questions about going to a one percent of clubhouse a biker run a event any type of stuff that they're holding you can hit me in the comments with that shout to everybody that's been supporting the clothing the demons row clothing is doing very well i want to come out with the mask because a lot of people have been asking me about the mask that i wear and i need to try to figure out a connect so i can get that custom for all of us so we could just ghost you know what i mean and in our own way you know what i mean that should be super dope so i definitely want to do that 
follow me on instagram at demons row at souls the ghost underscore and thank you for tuning in to demons row tv the holy grail of mc culture like subscribe and comment and oh yeah we ghosting baby